Hello and welcome to another teaching from 119 Ministries. Our ministry believes that the whole Bible is still true and directly related to our lives today. If you would like to learn more about what we believe and teach, please visit us at testeverything.net. We hope you enjoy studying and testing the following teaching. It is commonly taught in mainstream Christianity that our Messiah came in the first century to change the law of God. Some examples of the law the Messiah came to supposedly change is the Sabbath as well as other appointed times found in Leviticus 23 and even the dietary instructions found in Leviticus 11. But our Messiah said he did not come to change the law of God, but to teach us through example to practice it and teach it to others that we might be great in the kingdom of God. Matthew chapter 5, verses 17 through 19. Do not think that I have come to abolish the law or the prophets. I have not come to abolish them, but to fulfill them. For truly I say to you, until heaven and earth pass away, not an iota, not a dot will pass from the law until all is accomplished. Therefore, whoever relaxes one of least of these commandments and teaches others to do the same will be called least in the kingdom of heaven. But whoever does them and teaches them will be called great in the kingdom of heaven. Not only did our Messiah say he did not come to change the times and the law, but the prophets state that it is the heart of the Antichrist to change the appointed times and law of God, not the heart of our Messiah. Daniel chapter 7 verse 25, He shall speak words against the Most High, and shall wear out the saints of the Most High, and shall think to change the times and the law. Most understand what it means to change the law. To change the law is the same as breaking Deuteronomy chapter 4, verse 2, which forbids adding to or taking away from the law of God. Deuteronomy chapter 4, verse 2, You shall not add to the word that I command you, nor take from it, that you may keep the commandments of the Lord your God that I command you. That is the heart of the Antichrist, to add to or take away from the law of God, or also known as the Torah. But what does it mean to change the times in Daniel chapter 7, verse 25? Daniel 7 was written in Aramaic. The Aramaic word in this verse that is translated into English, times, is ziman, which means, according to Strong, a set time, appointed time, or time. The Hebrew word equivalent is moed, or plural, moedim. The moedim, or appointed times from our Creator, are listed in Leviticus 23. So, To change the times as it relates to the law of God is to change the biblical holidays declared by our Creator in Leviticus 23. Most of mainstream Christianity does not observe any of the Bible's appointed times because they mistakenly believe that our Messiah taught against them. We are the first to admit that there are some difficult verses to understand in the New Testament as it relates to the law of God. Acts chapter 10 Acts 15 and several verses of Paul do seem to imply to many that the law of God changed through the Messiah. However, unless we wish to accuse our Messiah in doing the work of the Antichrist, that perhaps we should re-examine those commonly misunderstood verses in the New Testament. To start, we would recommend the following teachings. Acts chapter 10, Peter's vision. Acts chapter 15, obedience or legalism. And the Pauline paradox series. We pray that this has given you something to consider. We implore you to test all of this to his word. We hope that this teaching has blessed you. And remember, continue to test everything. Shalom. Help us better serve you and your family. Subscribe to the 119 Ministries email updates by visiting the link on your screen. By subscribing, we will keep you current on all of our new teachings, articles, blog posts, free giveaways, promotional items, and more. You will not only remain up to date on all of the happenings of 119 Ministries, but you will have early access to all of our new video teachings. So don't hesitate. Visit the link on your screen and sign up today.